welcome everyone to NXT. The atmosphere in the NXT arena is off the chain tonight. Here we go and we're with the The time for talk is over. Next up, we're going to a new champion crown. We have one of our breakout talents against an adversary. And we are guaranteed a new champion tonight. I can't wait. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. Vicious strike. What a stomp. Good grief. This might be it. Oh, my. Forcefully delivered. Oh, hanging off for dear life. Oh, alley oop power bomb. That might be it. Himself here, but he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. Yeah, but it looks to me like he still has plenty of energy in that body of his. I wouldn't look too much into this right now. I know anything is possible, but I just can't envision a new champ being crowned here tonight. The champ just comes into tonight with too much momentum. Play drop! He's making a statement here with this attack. Byron, I agree that the champ comes into tonight. Here we go. DDT. This could be it. He's in trouble. Cross the shoulders. Down, Samoan driver. But he's got to capitalize now. His shoulders are down. Uh, this is dangerous right here. Whoa. Knee drop. That was nasty. So precise. This capacity crowd starting to sense the end is near, and I don't disagree. Tonight may not be a night, guys. He is hurt. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. He needs to create some space and find a way to get back on the offensive. This is exactly the opening his opponent was looking for. It wasn't easy to find, but hey, he found it. The blatant disrespect for the officiating gets this one waved off.
The WWE is the gift that keeps giving. Next, get for some WWE magic. Hold on to your seats. We have singles coming up next against an imposing adversary. Superstars have it. You have to walk in believing you're going to beat up your opponent. Kevin Owens can be when he snaps. It doesn't matter if you're a friend or the CEO of WWE. Owens gets a sadistic look in his eyes that says he no longer cares about human life anymore. continues. He's a guy that can turn it on whenever he wants. Kevin Owens. Pump handle applied. Oh, right across the knee. It, is that it? Is it over? This is exactly what Kevin Owens was waiting for. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Be a talk for the next 
to live up to its billing, but optimistic. Eagles match on tap next. Hold on to your seats. We have action coming up next. Oh, oh yes. And the simple philosophy here is to stay as far away from the tables as humanly possible. Sounds easy, right? Wrong. Hey, Corey, what's been your favorite Mr. McMahon moment? When he was shaved bald or locked lips with Rikishi's posterior? For the safety of my job, I will not answer such questions, oh, wow. Byron. And if you value your job, you shouldn't be asking such questions. Wait, wait, wait. You know what? On second thought, ask me some more. Uh, uh, wait. Good point. You want to talk about WWE Hall of Famers taking things to the extreme? The first time many fans saw somebody put through a table was in 1984. Randy Macho Man Savage drove Ricky Morton of the Rock and Roll Express through a table with a pile driver at the Mid-South Coliseum. Seen in wrestling magazines, the pile driver was utilized when Terry Funk planted Nature Boy Ric Flair on a table at WCW's Wrestle War '89 pay-per-view. Then something happened in sports entertainment in the early '90s called Extreme Championship Wrestling. ECW superstars crashed through tables all the time. And what was going on in Philadelphia caused a craze of wood being turned into wood chips thanks to tables matches. In order to win a tables match, a competitor must be the first person to put their opponent through a table. We've also witnessed brutality evolve and superstars crash through flaming tables. Beautiful technique. Mr. McMahon bought the company that would become WWE from his father, Vince McMahon Sr., in 1982 and transformed it from a successful regional promotion in the northeastern part of the United States to a national and then international company. Oh, what impact! Mr. Perfect faltering some. He's really going to need to create some Ugh. space for himself. I wouldn't call for the medics just yet, Cole. He still appears to be in pretty good shape here. Up until 1997, most people thought Mr. McMahon was a WWE announcer. Did not know that he owned WWE. That revelation brought about an incredible change in sports entertainment as seen by Mr. McMahon's conflicts with Bret Hitman Hart and a historic rivalry with Stone Cold Steve Austin. The Attitude Era propelled WWE into the stratosphere as the company crushed Ted Turner's WCW in the Monday Night Wars. Mr. McMahon even survived an attempted overthrow by former WCW and ECW stars who were backed by his children and Paul Heyman, known as the Alliance. He's going for it all. Look at this, what a dive! Yes! Unreal performance! I can't believe what we just saw. Tables matches are fan favorites for a reason, folks. 
Oh, I can't believe this. Man, oh man, look at that. He's getting it done here. He really put on a great show. Here is your winner, Mr. Perfect. And it looks like that table shattered into hundreds of little pieces. We'll see if the next match. Coming up next, take on some petition. You don't want to miss it. submission or start a super kick party. And while he's dished out a few hangovers with his brother Jey Uso, he's more than capable of throwing a super kick party all by himself. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. That's how you wear down your opponent. Oh my goodness, this hurts! Oh. Here's the cover. Oh wow. Flying forearm. Oh, flying forearm on the mark. Oh, working on the arm. on the back. It's going to take more than that to keep his shoulders down. Not yet. Too early. Oh, flying forearm. That'll turn your lights out. He's taking some offense. He goes for the cover. No trouble kicking out of that one. Nice kick out there. The impact. At the arm. Headbutt. Now it's Jey Uso on the defensive. He's going to need to find a way to fire back. Hey, you're going to absorb some punishment in a wrestling match. It just goes along with the territory, and he knows that. I doubt he's all that concerned at this point. Look out, there he goes. Knocked right off his feet. When this guy's on, look out. Look at Brian Danielson. That creates a big opening here. Sometimes a little stretch can feel good. That, however, is anything but a little stretch. He breaks out. He's not done just yet, Michael. Uh, setting him up in position here on the second row. Nasty drop. How can 
Jey Uso be put on the offensive quickly here. Ouch. He needs to find a way to get on the offensive, guys. That you gotta believe this one's over. This might be it, guys. Jey Uso just came over well. It's gonna take more than that to keep him down. Wow. Yeah, he's got some magic working, that's for sure. Oh my goodness, crushing it. He's got him covered. This battle's not over yet. Just not enough damage done yet, Cole. Uh -oh. oh my goodness, crushing it! Arm is grapevine, trying to step through. Uh -oh. Here it comes. Tequila Sunrise is applied. Can he end it here? the submission and good thing that could have been disastrous jay about to attempt the big splash double underhook suplex jay uso not looking so good here this is not where he wants to be at this point in this match he has got to fight back jay uso can go back from this after all he has been down since day one ish what does that even mean Is what makes him one of the best in the business. Look at Brian Danielson. Just wearing down the opponent. And that will likely end Jay's night. Wow, he got out of it. Yeah, I'm not so sure he had it fully locked in. He might have it. Boom! <laughs> that has got to be it. Now, that's what he was looking for, Michael. Going for something else, it seems. I suspect he knows something that we don't, Cole. Why else would he just let him out of that hole? This may very well be it. up a huge victory here tonight. Much deserved, Michael. Yeah, but I don't think his opponent is happy about losing here. I mean, he's got to be humiliated and embarrassed. He thought he was going to win this match. Oh, I kind of did too. And now the everybody in the building giving me time for the Royal. Coming up the form of comp that personified the concept of every man for himself. In a match I am sure we will not soon forget. These six superstars are going to treat us to a battle royal to remember.
than when Big Show battled Umaga and the great Kali. One by one, the field cleared. The WWE Universe became unglued when Jeff Hardy eliminated the Big Show with a Hurricane Rana over the top rope. With the great Kali down, the charismatic Enigma followed that with a swanton bomb. But Kali's size and strength were too much, and the Giant eliminated Jeff Hardy to become the number one contender for the WWE Championship. In WWE, but few had the genuine emotion that Randy Savage and Miss Elizabeth shared, especially when they got married at SummerSlam in 1991. And look at what a slam! Impactful. It'll jar your spine. To echo Michael's sentiment about Randy Savage's wedding, it isn't uncommon for love to be found in WWE, but nothing compared to Randy and Miss Elizabeth. That match made in heaven got ugly at the reception hall when The Undertaker and Jake the Snake showed up uninvited. I guess all that love and sunshine can't last forever. Devastating elbow. Y2J is starting to fade. Looks to me like he's starting to feel the pressure, guys. He was one of my favorites heading into this battle royal, and I'm not ready to write him off the list just yet. He's got plenty of fight left in him. But if you're counting him out now, you have a rising elbow. That's a good way to find yourself on the list of Jericho. Nice job getting out of the way of that one. Nailed it. Harsh impact. What a strike. behind it. Uh -oh. At the arm. Oh, oh, oh man! Bret Hart knows what he's doing. If it was me, I would not be taunting anybody right now. six-man battle royal, I often think of how different the strategy is for a superstar who's competing in it. Yes, the objective is the same, to be the last person standing in the ring, but there are only 
these six superstars. You're not able to hide among the trees, so to speak, as well as the Battle Royals with 20, 30, or 40 superstars. When this guy's on, look at him. Bad spot for him to be in here, guys. He's got to do something to get back in this thing. Byron, you made a great point earlier. Just the launch. That's a good way to find yourself on the list of Jericho. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Well, better not think too long, though. It's not very often you see six superstars of this caliber competing at the same time. Uh-oh, watch out! Beautiful side rush and leg sweep. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. Huge toss. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Pretty amazing to see that this capacity crowd has been on his feet ever since this battle royal started. I don't know about you guys, but it looks to me like these superstars are on their last legs here. Oh boy, he is rolling. Nail oh the guard. That might just be the final nail in the coffin. Can Savage actually pull through? He's left wide open here. I don't think he even realizes it. He looks dazed. This is about to get bad. The final elimination. And this one is over. And here's a look back at some of the action from the previous match. He ain't playing here. Here is your winner, Chris Jericho. Now on tap for singles action coming up next. And Byron, you never want to... 
don't find yourself in a spot like this. Especially in a Royal Rumble match, Michael. Bray Wyatt making a move. Looks to make an elimination here. This might be it. Oh, There's the elimination, Byron. That was amazing. Counting it down, who is it going to be? Oh, no! Someone called you off the dust. It's Ryder. Long Island IC is in the house. Watch out. Backbreaker. That'll realign your vertebrae. Right across, right across the back of the neck. The impact. This will be number six. He's starting to stumble here. He's going to have to cut off his opponent's offense quickly. I know it's early, but if things stay the way they are, it's Dean Ambrose. Irish whip. Boom! What a right. Shoulder right to the midsection. If there's a maneuver that can put your lights out in a hurry, it's dirty deeds. The double R DDT from the lunatic fringe is awesome. Oh, what a slam. Let's listen to this crowd count the next one in. Here we go, guys. Elimination coming up. Set it up. Net breaker. That could be it. Here he comes, and he's got as good a chance as any to win this game. Maybe a better chance if you ask me. Look out, a possible elimination coming up. Way up, way down. What a sit-out spine buster. And gets out of harm's way. Oh, boy, that could have been bad, Michael. Zack Ryder with some reason for concern. Ouch. He's still got plenty of gas left in his... Number eight's about to enter. What a strike. Ooh. Oh, what a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. Heading this way. What a strike. Right on the mark. Boom. That, there's the elimination fire. That was amazing. What a strike. Boom. There's the elimination fire. That was amazing. Oh, and a backbreaker. Right to the spine. Who's it going to be, fellas? Vicious strike. Oh no, it's great to handle by the time. Ooh, what impact. Beautiful technique. Great the jump. What a shot. Dodges trouble there. You got that right, Michael. That had elimination written all over it. The 2013 World Rumble match had so many rivalries, debuts, and streaks all in one that made for an exciting night in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Match saw Kane make his 15th consecutive appearance in the Royal Rumble match, and the Rumble debuts of The Shield, Rusev, Cesaro, Big E, Luke Harper, Eric Rowan, and Fandango. That's the impact. Byron, I remember calling the action of the 2014 Royal Rumble and was shocked when I heard my bro number 10 will be joining us momentarily. Things are about to get interesting now. You can say that again. <laughs> oh, man! What a stop! Good grief! Ambrose Ooh. starting to struggle now. But it's going to take a lot more than that to stop him here tonight. The Royal Rumble match will absolutely test your resolve, guys. And that's exactly what we're seeing here with him. Yeah, but if you count him out now, guys, you'd be making a very big mistake. Mark my words. He's always had great stamina. See if it lasts here. Wow. Now, look out. There he goes. Knocked right off his feet. To leave a mark permanently. Harsh impact. We've seen 
this before. Pull away. Back. A and he there. There's the elimination for him. What took him so long? Could be trouble here, guys. You got a field for Adam Cole. Look, he's beaten down at this point. He's done. His outlook is not Ooh. good at all. Like everybody else, he's probably dreamed of main eventing WrestleMania. Given how he looks right now, though, he might just have to keep dreaming. Right there, guys, eliminated. with an exclamation point, no less. Trying for the elimination here. Looking for the elimination. He's got it right where he wants it. No, I guess going for something else here. Well, unless it results in an elimination, it's the wrong move. Looks to make an elimination here. Pick the lip. Oh, God, that hurt. Guys, I don't think we can watch a Royal Rumble match without mentioning the mastermind behind the epic event. Of course, that person is WWE Hall of Famer Pat Patterson, a true legend. Switching gears here, guys. Now, that's getting off the hook easy, if you ask me. Nice leg pick. A knee drop! Reflecting a bit more on Pat Patterson creating the Rumble, I can tell you that the concept wasn't initially welcomed with great fondness. <laughs> Imagine pitching a battle royal that starts with just two people. On paper, that's a tough sell. But when it comes to Patterson, you have to trust that he knows what he's doing. Oh boy, he is rolling. Wyatt kicking some serious tail here. Not where he wants to be right now. Hey, he got himself into this mess. He's got to get himself out of it now. Greg Valentine isn't sending any Valentines right now. That's for sure. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's lining him up. There he goes. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his soul ever does. And Valentine is on the move. Suplex. Hooked up. The kiss! Oh, impactful slam! But I don't know how much gas he has left, guys. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. Adam Cole! <laughs> well, there's the elimination, Byron. That was amazing. Trying for the elimination here. Nice job getting out of trouble there. Talk about a great escape. You gotta believe this one's over. Pick the lead. This might be it. Oh my. And Valentine on the move. Lined up elbow drop. But is it enough to defeat Wyatt here? Real Wyatt's just getting. seem to have tried everything in their playbook. Oh, there's more in their arsenal, I promise you that. I don't know what it is, but they'll find it. He's making a statement here with this attack. Bray Wyatt drives his opponent down with a Yurinagi. 
And there it is, boys. And Bray Wyatt might have just secured the victory. coming up this could be an elimination Corey I don't know it's going to take more than one superstar to get this job done there's the elimination and the elimination put this in the books let's take another look and see why the Royal Rumble is a highlight of the WWE calendar wow I've sat ringside for some sorry matches, but that had to be one of the sorriest. It leaves a bad taste in my mouth. All I can say is thankfully that match is over. That had to be one of the most pathetic performances I've ever seen.